Victoria, mm -hmm. hey, hi, Travis here. Do you know how embarrassing it is to have your smoke alarm battery go off when you're a firefighter? Because you were supposed to buy batteries when you went grocery shopping. OK, I don't remember that being signed. I texted you while you were in the store. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. Mm. Sorry, I was there. OK, you're supposed to be conflict mm. resolution. <laughs> huh. What? My dad just texted me, going to San Diego next week with Kyle. Could you check on your mother once or twice? It says Kyle's secret boyfriend, Kyle. Kyle's secret boyfriend, Kyle. Hey, guys, 23's almost here. Barn, now. Coming. Jeez. She thinks it's a conference, by the way. Oh, wait, so your dad is going? Going on vacation with his lover and wants me to cover for him. Yeesh. Oh, fun, a wedding. Guess that makes us the groom side. Oh, damn. Is that the fire side? <laughs> OK, OK, everybody, shut up. We're here for some training. Just like any other day, I'd like to finish by dinner so I don't have to share my meatballs with 23. Dee Dee, can we get started, please? Thank you. Hi, everybody. Um, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Diane Lewis. Hey, Diane. Good to see you again, Pat. Today, I'm here in a different role than many of you may know me. In addition to my work as a grief counselor, I'm also certified in crisis intervention training. Now, as you know, Dean Miller has spearheaded the Crisis One Woo! program here in SFP. And we're all very proud. Now, you'll find all your protocols in there. You probably know most of them already. We're just reframing them through this program with the goal of eliminating the police and their weapons from the situation. Now, mental health crisis can evoke fear. An armed response leads to unnecessary trauma and, in the worst cases, loss of life. So why don't we just uh, jump right in with some role play? OK, lucky for us, we have our very own married couple in the house, Herrera and Sullivan. Why don't you come on up here, and we'll start on page seven with the marital dispute scenario. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Or we could take volunteers. No, I'm game. I'm game. I'm game. Herrera? Fine. Yeah. Let's do it. We're going to be role-playing scenarios that you may encounter while on Crisis One calls. Your job is to secure the scene, build trust and rapport with the patient, and find a solution if you can. Now, I will be the responder for this first one. You two are the married couple. The wife has locked the husband outside and is throwing his stuff out on the sidewalk. Someone called 911 because the husband is screaming and threatening her. Okay, Diane, I think maybe we should not. Are you crazy? Hmm? Uh, Roberto, do not call me crazy. You, you screwed my best friend. I did no such thing. <laughs>